What's up guys and welcome to Predications Daily Tech Tips. In today's tech tip, I'll be showing you how to prepare a bootable disk for Windows 11. Now, if you want to install Windows 11 using a flash disk or a USB drive, you need to create a bootable disk first. And in today's video, I'm going to be showing you how to do just that. Now, the first thing you need to do is obviously get the ISO file, the image file of Windows 11. Now, currently, there are some sketchy websites providing a leaked copy of Windows 11, but you can wait until there's an official launch and it's going to be available on the Microsoft website. Whichever way you find it, simply download it and save it somewhere on your computer. Now, the next thing is to prepare a USB drive. Now, make sure you have a USB drive that's at least 8 gigs and make sure you clean out everything in it so there's nothing inside that USB drive and it's clean and ready to go. Number three, you need to get a software tool that you can use to create a bootable disk. Now, the tool I like to use is called Rufus and you can simply go to the Rufus website and download it and then you can run it. Now, this is now the Rufus application and the first step now is to select the device that you want to use. So select your USB drive, make sure you cram the letter or make sure you just get the right device. The good thing with Rufus is that it's smart enough to know which devices are removable disks and which ones are not. So it's going to probably select the right USB drive for you. And then in the next step, make sure ISO image is selected. And then in this select button, you want to click on that and that should take you to your file explorer where you can now go ahead and look for where you've saved your ISO file, the Windows 11 ISO file. Click on it once to select it and then click open so that it's now selected inside Rufus. Now just confirm it's the one selected right there. There you go. And when you see a check mark, you'll know that that's the correct file. Now you can leave everything else exactly the way it is and go down to format options. Now in the format options, you want to give uh, your USB drive a name because it's going to be formatted and it's going to be made into a bootable disk. I'm going to call mine Windows 11. Now everything is done and all you need to do is click on start and allow Rufus to use your USB drive and the ISO file to create a bootable Windows 11 USB stick. Of course you'll be warned that this process will delete everything in your USB drive but I already knew that so click OK and uh, just wait for the process. Now this might take a while so you might want to go and grab a cup of coffee or something to eat and uh, allow this slow process to go on. It should take about 10 to 20 minutes, depending on your speed of your computer anyway, or sometimes it might even take longer. But be patient, go do something, and wait for this process to happen. A few moments later. And when it's done, it's gonna say it's ready, and all you need to do now is click on close, and your USB drive is ready to be used as a bootable disk to install Windows 11. Thanks for watching. You can leave your comments and questions down below. Don't forget to share and subscribe for more tips. Until the next one, my name is Chris and I'll talk to you guys soon.